Hey friends, Allison Creamer here with your um, August update, the things that happened in um, our real estate market in August. It is now September 8th and uh, the report has just come out, so it's kind of a mixed bag. Um, I do have to do a little reading off my screen, so if my eyes come off, I'm sorry, but um, we see a trend here and I like it. Uh, I think we're getting a little closer to a balanced market, which is phenomenal. Balanced means that you have a, about a six month inventory, so um, when I get through the report, you'll see why I'm pretty excited to be a realtor here in Hampton Roads right now. Our residential listings um, in August, they were actually down by 15%. When your listing inventory goes down, it actually starts to balance the market a little bit more. So the less houses we have to choose from, buyers will make selections and continue to move forward. Um, that almost beat the decline for 2004, um, which where the inventory had dropped by 16.7%. The residential under contract sales grew by 23.4%, so that means listings went down and people wrote a lot of offers in this past month, which is phenomenal. Now we don't know if that's going to equate into actual sales, um, it just took a lot of homes off the market and put them under contract, um, which does help the market as well. Again, the less amount of inventory you have, the buyers tend to have to make choices um, and move forward. So the largest gains, which was interesting, was Newport News. They gained. 57%. Norfolk was the second largest at 49%. So again, those cities were experiencing a nice boom and um, hopefully that means that their markets are improving as well. The bad news for sellers but not for buyers is that the median sales price for the homes actually dropped another 6.8%. So right now our market is about um, 195000 which is our median sales price. Um, that's the middle ground between everything that's above and below it. That's about the right in the middle. Another really interesting fact is our bank owned or short sales. They Active listed for sale, it's about 22% of our market. So 22% of the homes that are available right now are actually distressed. And it took about 29.3% of our total uh, closed volume uh, was distressed. So again, 70% of our market is still balanced. Uh, we have seen those numbers change a little bit. Overall, the distressed market is declining, which is pretty good. Um, it says that year over year, it's dropped. The high was 2,896 seven distressed properties and currently we're at 2,526 distressed properties so it's starting to come down. Our current market um, holds about 9.27 months of inventory. A balanced market is actually about six months. Um, so we are seeing a little bit of decrease in the um, inventory and the amount of time that it takes to get the homes off the market. So I know that was a lot of statistics. We'll also put it in blog form and bullets so that you can read it. Thanks, guys. Uh, look forward to working with you. If you haven't checked out buyhamptonroadshomes.com or you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, and, of course, through just Googling Allison Creamer.